am here with my very first lip monthly bag, I think. I think sometimes it's come in a box, I think it's a bag, feels like a bag. Um, it's $10 a month. It is a supposedly a lip subscription. Sorry, I am all in my mommy glam here. Um, I put my makeup on hours ago, and as you can see, my lip product has worn off. But I decided, because it came and I was excited and I wanted to open it, um, that I would not put anything on my lips. And then when I hopefully figure out something in the bag that I want to try, want to show you, or I think looks beautiful, I will stick that on my lips for the rest of the day. But um, anyways, I will leave the link below for Lip Monthly. This is my very first bag, so I have nothing to say about it going into it other than I paid for this myself. I am totally curious. I signed up for this. I also get BoxyCharm and Ipsy. And then I will kind of pick and choose what I want to stay with and what I don't. This one I got, I think, three months... no... I don't know. There was some sort of a discount. So if I can find a good discount, I will link one below. I absolutely, to the best of my knowledge, don't get any credit for anything. Maybe if I refer you, I really don't know. But um, anyway, here is the mailer. I tore it open like the child I am. And then here is the bag. It's a blue bag with little pink lips. It is bigger than an Ipsy bag. I don't know, like the size of my head or so. Um, and it does seem a little bit more sturdy than some of the Ipsy bags. It smells a bit like a pool float, but I think that's just the nature of the um, the beast. But let's see, it's so far in here. Looks like I have one, two, three, four, five products, but we'll see. There is a card. It says, um, follows here. We've lined up a unique variety of items this month that you'll love. This month we've included three lip products as well as a nail polish and a moisturizer. But the whole thing is a lip subscription, so I don't know how I feel about that, but I'll reserve judgment. Um, we feel nail polish will complement your lip items for this month and previous months. Your moisturizer is a great goodie to have as fall approaches. FYI, we have a new reward point system for every one friend you refer, you receive 50 reward points. Reward points can be used to redeem your currency at our shop as well as for free boxes, blah, 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 blah. And it lists the retail value of everything, which I haven't looked at yet. I will share that with you. Sorry, I put that up so you can pause it and look later. Do I talk too fast? Let me know in the comments below. Okay, the first thing, this is a nice moisturizer. It's the Pure Lease Pure Moist Hydro Balance Moisturizer for normal to dry, sensitive, and anti-aging, which is nice because I am aging and I have dry skin and it can be sensitive skin. So that's okay, the Pure Lease, let's see. Daily moisturizer, um, it retails for $18, probably not this size, I, I, I would hope, because, well, anyway. The next thing is the Ecolips Hemp Vanilla Organic, I assume it's a lip balm, says it's GMO free and cruelty free. There it is there, and this retails for $3.49, so, yeah, I mean, Ipsy does stuff like this, and then it's fine, it's a lip bag, um, and I have two kids with very dry lips, um, I assume I will have a third with very dry lips, but so far she's good, um, so even if I don't like it, at least it's something healthy that I can put on my kids. Do you want me to open it? Do you want me to smell it? Should I smell it? I'll smell it. It says to twist to open it. That was easy, thank goodness. I always put it on my nose. I don't love the way it smells. It doesn't smell bad, but I don't, I'm not like, oh, you guys. You know, anyway, it's fine. And then, I don't know how this is a fall nail color, but it's the Jessie's Girl nail color in... Case 3C. Oh, there it is on the side there. Anthony, which I love that name. It's a big family name for us. Um, so this retails for $3.99. I believe you can also get Jessie's Girl at Rite Aid. I don't have a Rite Aid right by me, but there are some in my area. So um, I have like one other. No, why did I say Jessie's Girl? Julie G. I don't know. Sorry about that. No, you know what? How funny. This says Jessie's Girl Cosmetics, but the polish, I don't know, how funny. It says Jessie's Girl Cosmetics there, but the polish says Julie G. So apparently, I don't know. That's my story. The next thing is this Sheremoya is how I would guess it said. C-H-E-R-I-M-O-Y-A Lip Crayon in Coral. Again, not so much a fall shade, Lip Monthly. 
kind of kind of I mean it matches the nail polish maybe but I'm kind of disappointed in their fall selections I, I I'm confused but uh, so this is the packaging it doesn't feel in any way I don't know special or anything it's just like a jumbo lip crayon there's the point to begin with it does twist up which is nice It kind of has like maybe a lemony scent. Let's just, whoa, that's not a color I'm normally gonna wear. But it's creamy. Yeah, and I the scent is nice, but it's, it is like a <laughs> Pepto pink. Not so much a coral in my world, but okay, okay. And it is, it does, well, it says it's matte, but I'm going with satin on the finish there. I don't know. So there's that. It says that I suspect is full size and that retails for $8, which I think I would skip it for $8. Um, and then we got um, a Sheramoya Lip and Eye Retractable Pencil. <laughs> if you guys watch my unboxings at all, you know I'm pretty much over. I, I'm over the eyeliners. I'm done. I'm I'm good. Unless you're sending me a liquid liner, we can we can probably pass. And I have the worst time opening these. Tell me I'm not alone. Just a moment, please. Okay, that took way too long, but I got it open, and it's the Sheramoya. It says it's a lip and eye pencil. It's retractable. It's waterproof. It is in the color latte. So if you guys are using this on your lips, please send me pictures. Okay, actually, you probably could. I mean, I probably wouldn't, but if you wanted to, like, maybe tone down this coral with, it's a brown. I mean, I don't know how brown it's coming off. It does have a slight mauve hint to it. It is super creamy, which is really nice. I mean, it is retractable, which is really nice. It does seem to have a little bit of a click on the closure, which is nice. Um, but yeah, it has, like, a cafe Olay kind of color to it. So, that retails for $3.99. You guys, I left my lips bare for you so that I could try on my amazing lip products. And I am um, like a china balm for you. And you can see what my lips look like with lip balm on it. Or I could try on the one other lip product that came in my lip monthly bag. So, so far, as you can see, I'm not super wowed, but um, it's not a bad bag. I mean, if it had been Ipsy, I probably would have been like, oh, okay. But I bought this one because I wanted lip stuff. So, because I love you. I will try on the only lip product with color that came in my bag. No, I will not line my lips with the latte liner. But let's, uh, again, not a color I normally, normally go for. Oh, you guys. <laughs> so unflattering. Oh, look at, look at. Can you see how, um, it just shows off? <laughs> oh, mm, that is so flattering. I can't even tell you. <laughs> On that note, you guys will see you later. <laughs>